how are you doing today? It is my prayer that you have been doing well and the Lord has kept you safe. Thank you once again for tuning in. I come to bring you another word that the Lord has put in my heart and that I love sharing with you. Uh, today, in today's video, I want to share with you a word that let every evil and opposing mountain melt like wax. You realize that in our journey of faith, in our life as children of God, even as human beings, we face a lot of opposition. These oppositions are known as mountains. And the intention of these evil mountains is to hinder us, is to limit us, is to discourage us from pressing on. Because remember, we are in a battle. And in this battle, even though we are assured of victory, we must fight. We must bring down these mountains because if we allow these mountains to oppose us, if we allow these mountains to continue hindering us, what the enemy wants to do is to abort your destiny, is to terminate your divine assignment because the enemy knows that if these mountains are removed, you will become a sign and a wonder. The enemy knows if these mountains are removed, you are going to become a deliverer and a leader like Moses. And therefore, what does he do? He keeps bringing mountains. He keeps bringing mountains and more mountains. But I want to read the word of the Lord and I want to assure you and encourage you. It does not matter how many mountains are opposing your destiny, but today they must melt like wax. The word of the Lord says in the book of Psalms, chapter 97 and verse number 1 to 5, I am reading from the New King James Version, the Lord reigns. Let the earth rejoice. Let the multitude of earth be glad. Clouds and darkness surround him. That means they surround God righteousness and justice are the foundation of his throne. A fire goes before him. That means a fire goes before our God and burns up his enemies around about. Verse number four, his lightnings light the world. The earth sees and trembles. And now to the verse, the core scripture of today's message, it says in verse number five, the mountains melt like wax at the presence of the Lord uh, at the presence of the Lord uh, of the whole other. I want you to understand uh, that even though this evil mountain uh, they represent uh, networks and forces of the demonic world uh, that are on an evil mission and assignment and an, an agenda to stop you and hinder you from fulfilling your God given assignment. Uh, their agenda is to frustrate you. Their agenda is to stop you and to make you should make you eventually give up and throw in the towel uh, and say I quit uh, I give up on my assignment uh, and remember if you give up on your assignment uh, you will not serve your generation uh, and your legacy will not be a good one uh, and therefore I want to tell you today as we get in declarations and prayers uh, I want you to agree with me you know the mountain uh, that has been hindering your life uh, you are understand very well uh, which is this mountain uh, every time you try to arise uh, every time you try to put up something uh, the mountain shows up uh, but today there is hope for you because the Lord is telling us in his word uh, and remember the word of the Lord is powerful the word of God is firmly established in heaven uh, and therefore as we decree as we reinforce uh, as we release this word in the atmosphere. Every mountain must melt like wax uh, because the Lord, the God of heaven, uh, he reigns in every area uh, of your life. Uh, I decree and declare every evil mountain reigning illegally in any area of your life uh, must be permanently flattened uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, that mountain uh, that has been opposing your advancement, uh, your promotion, uh, your elevation, uh, your advancement to the next level that mountain must melt like wax uh, in the name of Jesus Christ
Christ, uh, arise and declare with me, you evil mountain, uh, you must melt like wax. Uh, I decree and declare that evil mountain uh, that has been illegally saturating your days, uh, your hours, uh, your times, uh, and even your ears uh, with cycles of pain, uh, shame after shame, uh, misery, that mountain uh, must melt like wax uh, at the presence of the Lord Almighty. How many know there is no demonic mountain, uh, there is no satanic force uh, that can withstand uh, the presence of the Almighty God, uh, that evil mountain, uh, I decree and uh, declare, that evil mountain uh, that has been opposing uh, your spiritual growth, uh, that has been polluting uh, your garment of salvation uh, with stains of sin, uh, immorality, and all manner of evil perversions, uh, that mountain must melt like wax, uh, you must operate uh, in a dimension of righteousness. Uh, you must operate in holiness. Uh, you must walk in accordance with the decrees of the Lord. Uh, because this mountain must melt like wax. Uh, in the name of the God of heaven. Uh, I decree and uh, declare that evil mountain uh, that has been drying up uh, the oil of your prayer altar. Until you cannot even be able to pray. That evil mountain uh, that has been drying up uh, the oil of your anointing. Uh, making you become lazy, feeble, and weaker uh, in your prayer life. Uh, that mountain must melt like wax right now. Open up your mouth and decree and declare even as I'm decreeing uh, that mountain must uh, melt like wax. Uh, you must become a prayer warrior. You must pray without ceasing uh, because if you do not pray, you're about to become a prey for the enemy. The enemy is about to tear you apart uh, in pieces uh, and bring you down but I'm excited because that evil mountain uh, is melting like wax, uh, never to rise up again. Uh, I decree and uh, declare that intimidating mountain that has been filling your life with fear and insecurity, it must melt like wax uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, may you receive the boldness uh, like David received boldness uh, even though he was just a young teenage boy. The Bible says uh, he was able to slay Goliath, uh, not because he was bigger, but because of boldness, uh, receive the anointing of boldness uh, as that mountain of fear melts like wax uh, under the anointing of the Holy Spirit. Uh, I decree and uh, declare that river mountain uh, that has been drying up uh, your wells of faith uh, and making you feel like you are a grasshopper, like you are a chicken, uh, like you are a nothing. Uh, whereas you are a giant in the faith, uh, you are a giant in the spirit. Uh, I command you evil mountain uh, melt like wax uh, do a, do do an action of faith uh, arise and march uh, tell that day that mountain of fear lose my life uh, in the name of Jesus hallelujah to the Lamb of God uh, I decree and uh, declare that evil mountain uh, that is turning you into becoming a lukewarm believer must melt like wax uh, in the name of Jesus uh, I release the fire of the Lord Almighty that was upon Apostle Paul uh, into your life uh, in the name of the Lord. Uh, you shall not be a Christian uh, that is walking in cowardice, uh, but you shall be a believer that is fire filled, uh, full of the Holy Ghost, uh, full of the evidence uh, of the demonstration of the power of the Holy Spirit uh, in your life. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I decree and uh, declare that opposing mountain uh, that is hindering your entry oh, into your marital destiny must melt like wax uh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, that mountain uh, that makes men engage you and on the verge of them marrying you, they break the engagement. Uh, arise right now in prayer. Command that mountain uh, tell it to mountain uh, of my marital delay. Melt like wax uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and does that mountain melt like wax? Uh, I prophesy you are being ushered uh, into your divine marriage uh, in the name name of Jesus, uh, I command that evil mountain uh, that is hindering the manifestation uh, of the glory of God uh, in every area and sphere of your life uh, must melt 
right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, I decree and declare there has to be tangible evidence uh, of the glory of God uh, in your marriage, uh, in your health, uh, in your life, uh, in your every area of your life uh, because we are carriers of the glory of God uh, in the name of the Lord. Uh, that demonic mountain of deception uh, that has been hindering uh, the truth of the word of God uh, in your life, uh, that demonic mountain uh, that makes you, you cannot even get uh, the revelation of the Holy Spirit uh, of the word of the Lord. Uh, until now you are doubting uh, the truth of the word of law of the Lord. Uh, I command you in the mountain uh, melt like wax uh, by the fire of the Holy Spirit. Uh, and as that, that mountain melts, uh, receive the grace of revelation. Uh, receive the grace to understand the word of the Lord. Uh, word by word, uh, line by line, uh, precept by precept uh, to the glory of the most high God. Uh, I command that opposing mountain uh, that has been hindering your prosperity of your career, of the work of your hands. Uh, I command that mountain, uh, it must melt like wax. Uh, and as it melts like wax, uh, receive the grace uh, to create wealth uh, in accordance with the word of God. Uh, receive the grace uh, to make profit uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I decree and declare that mountain of defeat, uh, that mountain of failure in your life uh, that have been pursuing you from January all the way to this month. Uh, as we approach the end of this year, we command that evil mountain to melt like wax uh, and to lose its power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, somebody open up your mouth and decree and declare you evil mountain of failure. I command you to melt like wax. Uh, you must live a life of victory. You must live the life like a life of a child of God, uh, of dominion uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I command that evil mountain uh, that is hiding your glory and your beauty and pushing you into insignificance, uh, into oblivion uh, to melt like wax right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, you are remembered. Uh, you are about to be uplifted. Uh, you are about to showcase uh, the glory of God in your family. The people in your family that are not even believers uh, as this mountain melts uh, and as the Lord showers his glory upon you. They are about to say we need your God. Uh, indeed your God is a real dealer. In the name of the Lord uh, I command every mountain uh, of satanic powers uh, of demonic strongholds uh, that are contending uh, with your God given assignment uh, and destiny. We command that mountain uh, right now melt like wax. Uh, you will not die prematurely like Samson. Uh, I decree and prophesy you shall live out all your full days. Uh, you shall serve your generation. Uh, you shall have a great legacy. You are not going to be a nobody, but you are going to be somebody of influence, uh, of authority, of power. In the name of Jesus, uh, I decree and declare that every evil mountain uh, that is hiding your star must right now melt like wax in the name of Jesus. Uh, your star must shine. Uh, your star must shine uh, in your career, in your marriage, uh, in every area of your life. Uh, in the name of the Lord, uh, you can no longer be hidden. Uh, even Moses was hidden for a short time. Uh, I decree and declare it is your time to shine. Uh, in the name of the Lord, uh, I decree and I command uh, let every evil mountain uh, hindering the full manifestation uh, of your God-given talents, uh, giftings, uh, potentials and capacity. Let that mountain melt right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, the nations must hear your voice. Uh, your generation must know that indeed you exist. Uh, you are not going to live the life of a shadow, the life of a nobody. But I decree and declare as you agree with me in faith, uh, you are becoming a power to behold. Uh, you are becoming a force to reckon with. Uh, you are becoming a powerful generational influencer in your time. Uh, in the name of the Lord, uh, I decree and declare let every evil mountain uh, hindering you from living uh, a life uh, full of abundance of joy, peace of mind uh, and laughter. Let that mountain melt like wax uh, and that it melts like wax. Uh, let every veil of sadness, uh, let 
Let every veil of pain, uh, let every veil of heartache uh, be, be removed uh, and you receive the joy of the Lord, uh, which is your strength. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, uh, I command every demonic mountain uh, that is after your life, uh, that is saying you shall not see the end of this year. I command you evil mountain. Uh, what are you waiting for? Melt like wax. Uh, I command that evil demonic mountain uh, that is after your marriage, uh, that is threatening divorce, uh, that is telling you you married the wrong spouse. Uh, that devil, that mountain must melt like wax. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I command that satanic mountain uh, that is after your health, uh, I command it to melt right now by the power of the presence of the God of heaven uh, who wants a red by fire. In the name of Jesus, uh, I command that mountain uh, that is after the seed of your womb, uh, that is after the fruit of your womb, uh, that is after destroying uh, your generation. Uh, arise right now. Uh, let us command that mountain. Uh, your evil mountain uh, melt like wax. Uh, somebody arise and decree and declare uh, my generation uh, shall be great and mighty even in the nations uh, in accordance with the word of the Lord. Uh, your evil mountain uh, you must melt like wax uh, in the name of the Lord. Uh, I want you even as you are listening uh, arise and stand in agreement uh, with these prayers uh, and as you stand in agreement with these prayers uh, may you receive the strength uh, may you receive the power oh, to shine again uh, to dream again uh, to strategize again uh, to smile again uh, to laugh again uh, in the mighty name of the Lord uh, I decree and declare as you pray these prayers uh, every mountain is melting like wax uh, even the mountains you are not even aware of uh, but they work behind the scenes uh, they cooperate with the enemy and the devil of your destiny to bring you down uh, let all those mountains melt like wax uh, in the mighty name of Jesus uh, receive the grace uh, to conquer again uh, to walk in divine health uh, to enjoy your life to the fullest uh, to live a life uh, of a good health uh, and strength uh, in every area of your life in the name of Jesus. Uh, you will shine in your generation. You will stand firm in your faith. Uh, you will not backslide. Uh, you will soar like an eagle. You will become a sign and a wonder in your generation. Uh, receive the grace uh, to rule, uh, to govern, uh, to dominate the other. As so all these evil mountains are melting, uh, you will become a great person uh, in your generation. Uh, arise and smile again. Uh, arise and operate in victory because every evil mountain uh, that has been in operation uh, that has been pulling you down uh, in your life uh, has now been permanently melted uh, uh, like wax uh, in the name of Jesus uh, arise and celebrate Jesus uh, somebody arise and give him praise uh, somebody arise and tell the devil you have sat on me all these years uh, you have stopped me all these years uh, but not another day because even the word of God says there is a time and a season for everything and right now I prophesy because every evil mountain every satanic mountain every opposing mountain has now been melted like wax now you can march on to victory somebody put on your dancing shoes and marching shoes and march on to the next level until I see you next time remain firmly anchored in his presence because as we have read in his presence, every mountain must, not might or may, must melt like wax, like wax. God bless you.